right from the kickoff, Bohemian showed their intent, or maybe it was just Bray Wanderers doing the opposite. Keith Ward's shot came just 10 seconds into the game, saved by Mark O'Connor, but the writing was already on the wall. Goal number one came in the eighth minute. JJ Lunny and Keith Ward involved in the build-up, and with O'Connor off his line, an easy task for Dinny Corcoran to put the Gypsies ahead. He has now scored in all four games against the Seagulls this year. Three minutes later, and it was 2-0. Lunny's pass here, deflecting off Reese Gorman, and Keith Buckley with the assist this time. Corcoran with the sharp finish as Keith Longside continued their excellent late-season form. With players committed forward, Bray were caught on the break for number three. Shane Supple's quick throw was perfect. And it was Keith Ward again involved at the heart of things. Kevin Devaney with his fifth in the league this year. Only 25 minutes on the clock and the result already decided. There was more sharp passing in the build-up to number four. And it was that man, Corcoran, again on the end of it. A fine first-half hat-trick, again set up this time by Keith Ward. Bowes 4-0 up at the break. Bray Wanderers had their first real chance of the game after the interval. Darren Noon and Sean Harding setting up Jake Kelly, but Supple got down well to save. And that was just a brief respite for the Seagulls. Number five for Bowes was a real beauty. Derek Pender at the start of it. Keith Buckley with the ball over the top for Ward. And his perfect cross tapped in by Corcoran, who became the first Bowes player to score four in a league game since Jason Byrne against Dundalk in May 2009. That's ten defeats in a row for Bray, and the visitors had the freedom of the Carlisle grounds last Friday. A wonderful five-man move ended with Buckley on to Devaney. He set up Stokes, denied by O'Connor's save. Bowes completed their fourth win against Bray Wanderers this season, scoring 16 goals. Dinny Corcoran got seven of them. Final score, Bray Wanderers nil, Bohemians five, and no doubt about who was man of the match. Yeah, it's very disappointing when you shed so many goals, particularly obviously in the first half. We were very poor, um, and Bowes ripped us to shred re uh, really with our football, and we never got the grips. It was very disappointing. Hopefully, we can build on what's been a reasonably successful season for us, um, um, and, and and move forward together next year stronger. And uh, you know, if we keep putting in performances like we did tonight, um, I'm sure good times are around the corner. Mm -hmm.